Hello everybody, I'm Harold with Nature's Friends. Today is a mid-February, 32 degrees. We can't get outside in the garden, so we're gonna make an apple crisp today. This friend of ours, Mama's recipe, Mary and Fritz's Mama, Mary and Fritz. So we start out with six apples, our flour, sugar, cinnamon, and butter. I'll get the apples peeled and then show you what we're gonna do and how we mix everything up. Okay, we're back. We got our apples peeled. I'm finishing slicing them up. I was slicing them one way and Marcia said slice them the other way, so we're slicing them her way. We started out with six to eight apples. We use a gala apple. They don't cook up to mush. That's what we like to make our applesauce and everything out of. Okay, now we got our apples ready. We're going to spray our pan. Spread our apples in there. Okay, now we've got one cup of sugar, three quarters of a cup of flour, one stick of butter, room temperature. Anytime you use that much butter, you know it's got to be good. Okay, and then we're going to use a teaspoon of cinnamon. Now, my hands are good and clean. We're going to mix this up. And this is going to make our crumb. That's the fun part about cooking. When Keaton gets old enough, he's gonna really love doing this. There's no easy way of getting this stuff off. Looks like half of it stuck to my fingers. Okay, now we'll rinse my hands off. <clears throat> That's good enough for now. Now we're just going to mix this right over the apple. Bake them in the oven at 350 degrees for about 45 minutes. I'm going to take it out in 45 minutes and show you what it looks like and I'll show you what it tastes like. Okay everybody, now the apple crisp is ready to come out of the oven. You can see how it looks. It's all melted together good, nice and crispy on top. I actually cooked it for 50 minutes instead of 45. I added five more minutes to it. So you can make Grandma Fritz's. No, it's Mama Fritz's, Marion Mama. Her apple crisp, and I hope you enjoy it. If you have any questions, you can email me at naturesfriends at embarkmail.com. Thank you.